Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Rini, this is the Enchanted Planner, and today I got a haul video for you. So my box from Rachel finally arrived, which is my buddy in the States that I usually ship a bunch of stuff to. Um, so I'm gonna go through it with, yeah, some of this stuff is mine, some of it might be Maryland's because I didn't get one of these books. Somehow things got screwed up, but it's all good. So, as you all know, I absolutely love <laughs> this washi tape set. So I ordered another one because I don't want them to sell out on me and not have any. <laughs> okay, then I ordered another couple of these sets of bookmarks. I use them in my dashboard planner and I don't know why I wanted a second set of them. I don't know exactly what my motivation was for that because I ordered them back in January when I got them on super cheap. So I will find a purpose for them and if not, I'll sell them <laughs> because I don't know. I don't know, I had a reason. I think one was for the budget planner, but I can't quite remember. It's a bad brain fuzz day, so what am I gonna do? Now, up next is the original spring boxes. And here's an odd story. I actually ordered this book, two copies of it last year, and it went to Rachel's house, it arrived there, but somewhere it, between Rachel's house and my house, it, they got lost. They were not in the book. They were not in the box when they arrived or the box arrived at my place. So I paid for sticker books I never freaking got, which kind of pissed me off because I think UPS busted the box open. And then when they threw everything back in, those two didn't go back in the box. So from that point forward, I <clears throat> get Rachel to like basically super glue the bloody box closed with <clears throat> packing tape. And then I bought the new spring boxes because, you know, I love the boxes. However, you know, you can never have too many, right? So these are really pretty. I like, I quite like these. Not so sure about that, but you know, <laughs> it's not that I hate foil. It's just foil is such a pain in the butt to photograph. So, but that's okay. We make it work. <clears throat> okay, so I bought two copies of that. I also bought a copy of the Go Wild book because it's a lot of purple and we all know how I feel about purple. I'm not fond of this, I'm not gonna lie. Not fond of it. I'll have to play with it and see how it goes with things because I find that a lot. Don't discount a pattern because you put it against something and it actually looks really cool. Like these will probably work really well with spring spreads. I, I need to be a little bit more hay. I got to back up, give it some, give it some room, give it a, <laughs> give it a chance. The rest of this book though, I absolutely love. Okay, so that's the go wild. Now, up next is Posh Spring, which I'm pretty excited about. But for some reason, I only ordered one copy and I'm not sure why. These are beautiful. Oh, these have got like a place coming up pretty soon. I don't like it when these pages do that. Like there's something going on here. Watercolor florals. These are from her very first sticker book. That's this page. Well, let me show you the complete page. <laughs> Those are these. And I'm actually surprised. They're really, I prefer florals on clear because they're always so much more vibrant but there's actually that's pretty good pretty dang good okay so those stickers and the, the and the coordinating butterflies up here are also from that sticker book pretty 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 this would be fun that's got kind of a old dream seeker feel to it with the feathers and the flowers I'm not, I mean, these are pretty, don't get me wrong, but I don't like rinky dink little tiny things. I like big decor. I'm also not particularly fond of these. Like I would like, if I'm buying florals, I'm going to live, love, pause to buy florals. I just want florals. Florals and quotes are great. Even the functional stuff, like the, what she does in the functionally chic stuff, that's kind of cool. But I really want the florals. And then I bought the Love Yourself sticker book, which there are some florals in here that I absolutely love but I only bought one copy of this book too, which is odd because normally I buy two copies, not necessarily of this stuff, like with the fitness and florals and the plant babe and stuff. I only bought one copy of those. These are cool. I 
I love these colors together. Got a bathtub scene going on. Very fun. Oh my God, look at the daisies. <laughs> these, are, these are awesome. These are awesome. These are gorgeous. I think this is the whole reason I decided I wanted this book was these florals. They're unique. Kind of cool, right? And then we got this yoga thing going on. These are pretty too. Yeah, fun. And then I bought um, two copies of the Beautifully Lined because I love lined florals. These are fun. I don't know what I'm going to do with them. Actually, they might work for Abstract April because they're kind of fun. Yeah, look at these. These are so pretty. Again, pages kind of sticking together. These are neat. That's definitely different. And then what we got, those are kind of fun. Ooh, look at these. That is gorgeous. That's right up my alley. Nice, fun, fun, fun. These are fun. They're thicker lined florals, but they're still fun. But you see, you can layer these really easily and put color behind them quite well. So that's why I kind of like them because they give you a lot of options. I mean, you can make them look like this without having to actually have those, if that makes sense. Fun. Okay, so that is those two. Then I got these, which I have not had before, but I'm pretty excited about. <clears throat> I thought they had numbers. I thought they had numbers in these ones, but apparently not. But that's okay. I will put them to good use. Those are fun. And then, of course, I got another copy of these guys because I use these a lot. I love them. Now, we're going to move into a book that for some reason I did not end up with. I don't know if I had an error on my end, but I only ordered one copy and I know Marilyn wanted uh, one. So this is actually Marilyn's. So I have to place another order with Live Love Posh because I actually really want this sticker book. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Call it Menno Brain. For some reason, I only ordered one copy. These are beautiful. Yeah, these are fun. I'm not too big on like the Mickey Mouse in here because I, I don't we, not, we don't go to Disneyland. Like I don't live anywhere near Disneyland. I've never been to Disneyland, but they're still fun. Like this is fun. Oops, I'm having issues here. Hold on. And then the box is unfunctional. These are pretty. You belong among the wildflowers. It's pretty, pretty, pretty. These are nice. I really like this kind of look. She did this in the spring book from last year with some of these like, you know, light bulbs and stuff. And they're fun. They're different. Oh, Valentine's Day. That should have been in a winter book. <laughs> but that's okay. These are cool. Or a really dark blue, but those are fun. And then we've got, of course, the front with some Easter stuff, right? Which is kind of fun. So this is actually, I'm going to get, I'm going to give it up to Marilyn <laughs> because for some reason, I only ordered one copy, but she ordered basically the same stuff I did. And then I ordered another one of these. I got this on a really good discount at Joann's because I like the fact that it is completely neutral. So I am set now for next year for a budget planner if in case they don't bring out something that's not neutral, if that makes sense. Because I've, like, I've got mine right now going for 2023 and then this one will work for 2024 if they don't bring out anything in the release at Christmas that is neutral for budget planning because some reason Happy Planner insists on going with rainbow for budget planning. I'm like, I don't want freaking rainbow. Okay, I think that is a wrap, you guys. I got it all. It wasn't a massive order that I had shipped off to um, Rachel simply for the fact that the exchange rate right now is absolutely crap. It is so bad. Um, I think I'm going to be restricting ordering a lot of stuff for a while just because the dollar is so bad. Like everything's costing way more than it should. <laughs> way more than it should when I have to convert it into US funds. But let me know what you think in the comments. Did you order any of these sticker books? If you did, what do you think of them? All right. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.